okay what happened basically in agile first of all you get a product vision that we want to create something we want to build something a customer requested or the company wanted that we want to build something so you make a product vision that this thing has to be built then you break down that product vision into small stories those stories are known as user stories user stories user stories are like this as a user i want to do this so that this can happen we took we discussed the example of a banking system if i break down that example it will be in this way as a user i want to go on to the bank site and i want to pay my bills another user can also say that as a user i want to clear my credit card payments on bank as a user i want that the website is secure so that my money is safe and another user can say that as a user i want the website to be flexible so you can get a many stories all the requirements that are given to you they in the form of user stories you take all those user stories and you make a product backlog of those user stories product backlog is nothing but a combination of user stories then the product owner here you don't call it as sponsor you call it as product owner he comes he prioritizes those stories like this is the number one story this is the number two story we want this story first implemented then this one then this one so this prioritization step is called grooming of product backlog once you have prioritized backlog with the priority has been set 1 2 3 4 you take or the development team takes user stories from the number 1 they take number 1 user story number 2 number 3 whatever they can complete in a duration of 2 to 4 week in agile scope is not fixed but time and cost is so time is mostly known as sprint 2 to 4 week you can also say that iteration the development team then break down this user story into small task and make a sprint backlog out of it so this they in this way they sequence those tasks that we do this first then do this daily meeting is occurred on the same time same day daily meeting is called as daily stand up or stand up daily in that meeting the things are discussed as what you have done yesterday what you will do today is there any road blocks or impediments in that that meeting is basically led by scrum master we don't have project manager here we have scrum master the role of scrum master is to ensure that the methodologies the processes of scrum are being followed then at the end of two or four week the sponsor come with the product owner with the team they discuss what we have made what we haven't made and they discuss all these thing in a meeting known as sprint review review of sprint review of sprint product owner sponsors client all those come and they see what you have delivered and then they again reprioritize the items the product backlog is again reprioritized maybe in 2 to 4 weeks the priority has been changed so once sprint review is done the product owner leaves then the team sit together they discuss with each other in a meeting how we are going to achieve all those things and they called it as sprint retrospective retrospective sprint retrospective the meeting in which they discuss the complete process so this is all about agile in a minute or two